and welcome back to crown geek in this video i will be explaining that how to record zoom meeting without permission so if you are in a meeting if you are in a seminar if you are in a classroom and if you want to record the whole session of your own self and even the participant who are connected on the zoom meeting i have a very good solution i have been using zoom for the last two years and finally i got a solution that really helped me uh, to record the session with a clear voice and the clear images of all the participant so right now my zoom application has been open so i will be sharing the method and how you have to use it how you can try this on the screen right away so right now if i go and start a new meeting session my webcam is on so i will share the call invite link and share with my friend so that uh, i can show you that how it record the whole participant and their voices and everything right so let me quickly send him the invite link all right so my friend is online now and now i will be showing you that how you have to record this session so this will be recording my own voice my own video and even the participant who is connected on the meeting all right so what you need to do you have to come to this website called video solo screen recorder once you come here you will find this software for both windows and mac operating system you have to click on free download it is small in size and it will be downloaded very quickly I have already downloaded so let me quickly uh, open it so once it comes up you can see that it's very uh, simple and easy interface that you can operate now once you come here what you have to do you get few options here like video recorder to record the session audio recorder to only record the audio and then you have the game recorder as well so if you want to stream or you want to record your gameplay then you can also use this option now after that we have some more options on the right hand side like window what does this mean like if you want to go and record your zoom meeting and want that your recorder should only record your zoom meeting and nothing else like in between if you want to use any other application any other browser software and you want that it should not record the other application except zoom meeting so you have to click on window then you can select zoom meeting from here and then click on ok now what will happen that it will only record your zoom meeting and if you open any other application it won't be recorded so now here you get few more options like system sound you can choose the sound option the microphone option whichever you want to choose and then you also have the another option of task schedule which means if you want to record any session in the future and you are scared or afraid that you may forget to record it then you can automatically schedule that task so that it can automatically record the zoom meeting session from its own cell all right so once you are done you have to click on record now this will be recording okay so uh, to in order to show you that how it works so i will say hi to my friend and you will see that the voice will be recorded hello hi now there are a few more options that you get here like during recording the session at the bottom you get a, a bag icon if you click on it then you get some additional options like you can uh, make some kind of shapes on the screen if you want to target any location then you have the text option if you want to write anything then you can click and type here whatever you want to write you also have the image icon so these are some additional options that you get absolutely free so you can check this option as well so now i will end it the recording has automatically stopped this is the recording and okay, now so, you can uh, hear it to, in order to show you that how it works so i will say hi to my friend and you will see that the voice will be recorded hello hi okay so this is how it works now the another best part is like you get for few more advanced options here after recording the session like if you have a look here right inside and at the bottom you will get an advanced uh, trimmer okay even if you want to uh, trim any part of the video so let's say that it's a recording of one hour and you only want to record only 20 minutes of the session then you can choose the duration here and the end time so that it can only uh, trim that part of the video so that is another best option which you are getting absolutely free all right now let me show you a few other options and settings like uh, if you go and click on this three line of the hamburger icon and if you go to the preferences the recording session you get all this kind of uh, information like where exactly you want to save the output file your video then you have show recording uh, boundary beep on start recording so that you can just check it on 
Then you have the output section where you get the directory setting, screenshot settings, video settings and video quality. You can choose it to high frame rate. You can even change to 60 FPS so that you can get more uh, deep and high quality uh, video. Now, once you come to the audio settings, you have the audio format, Kodak and the audio quality uh, options like you can choose between lossless, highest, high, middle or low. In the sound settings, you also get the option of microphone noise cancellation. But that's a paid feature, so you have to go with the paid version. So that's optional, as I said. Uh, once you love this option, once you uh, like this software, you can go with the paid version so that you can enjoy the premium version of this feature. Alright, so after doing this, there are a few more options like camera. So you can check the camera settings. Then you have the hotkeys. So this is an important part because if you want to record the session with a hot key, with a shortcut key, if you want to stop it, pause it, if you want to take a screenshot, then you can quickly set this hotkeys over here. All right. So these are the other options that you can check it on. And then in the more section, you also get some hardware acceleration option that you can uh, change it from here, depending that what kind of quality and what kind of performance you are getting, you can switch between these settings to see that whichever works for you. All right, so this is the best way guys. I showed you everything. If you want to enjoy this feature, you can go and download this application and record the Zoom meeting. And even this uh, application work with other uh, software as well. So that's all for today. If you found this video helpful, you can consider subscribing to the channel, like the video for any question, any doubt, let me know in the comment section. Till then, take care. Bye-bye.